Hi, this is Ron McTube. Today on the Hunter Call of the Wild, we're making a brand new Black Bear Hunting Guide. Now, with the recent updates to Silver Ridge Peaks, there's a lot of changes. So I've got to redo most of the guides because animal locations are different and their needs and times are different. Now, I'm going to a lake which I'm going to start calling Ron McTube's Diamond Lake. It's a tiny lake on a little mountain plateau. I had a diamond rocky mountain elk there in the last guide I made and now I've got a legendary mountain lion which keeps chasing a legendary black bear. So potential three diamonds at this lake since the update and I've never had a decent animal at this lake before. We'll cover this lake more in another video but I'm just going to talk about black bears today and the updates. So we're hunting during the night. The new need zone time for drinking is 8 at night to 12. And that may differ by 30 minutes either way, but 8 to 12 will cover the majority of the drinking need zones for black bears. I've got the 308, and we're going to hopefully get this black bear. Now the thing is, and this may change, so I might have to update it again, the mountain lions drink at 9 till 12. So they slightly overlap later on with black bears. And this is causing a bit of a nuisance. So hopefully that's changed in the future. But a little tip I've got for you. If you see a nice bear like I've got here, a legendary, and mountain lions are scaring it, kill the mountain lions. Do not collect them. Right? Leave their dead bodies there. Go back to your tent or hunt elsewhere, turn the time back, clear your hunting pressure, and then come back here at the black bear need zone times, drinking need zone times. Because if the mountain lions are dead and you haven't collected them, they won't respawn, so the bear should come back. Now if he's not coming back because of hunting pressure, clear that somewhere else, but just don't start your game again. Because otherwise they'll respawn, and you'll be in the same predicament. But yeah, the, the legendary mountain lion keeps chasing this bear. So I've been here about 20 times in the last two days trying to see this bear, which I've seen the first time because of the mountain lion. He'd spooked him. Uh, that's how I found him. But he's calm now because the mountain lions aren't there. So, this shouldn't be a hard shot. We're just going to get a nice position. I'm not going to shoot him front on because uh, you might get body. Broadside's always easier. So don't rush your shot if you've got a nice trophy animal. It doesn't matter the species. Take your time, wait, and then just take a nice, calm shot. You do all that grinding to get the special animal. There's no point in rushing once you've put in the work. So, what I'm trying to do is, I'm just trying to see if this that might be him. This uh, legendary mountain lion. I was going to save them for a guide, but I'm just wondering if they'll change the mountain lions. Because they are sort of messing up how animals are reacting um, on Silver Ridge Peaks. So that might be next. I might leave it. We'll see how that goes. So that's the legendary black bear down. Nice clean shot. The 308 is so good. It really is. But I can't find this legendary mountain lion. I was hoping to catch him running after the legendary black bear. I've had that before actually on the top right lake, I think it was. When we first started our, actually our last black bear great one grind. We got to nearly 1100 collected kills, but now we're starting again with the recent update. So it'll be interesting to see how this works out, whether you, they've altered anything or, you know what I mean, just changed certain things to do with black bears. I don't know if they have or not, um, so I am going to be starting my own Black Bear Great One grind again. So hopefully we'll get some nice animals. And we've just got our first legendary of the start of the grind. Now some people will leave these. Um, if you're hunting for a Great One Black Bear, what a lot of people do is they shoot only level 6 and above. And you stack your animals. So most people, or a lot of people, will leave up to level 9s alive. And just shoot sixes and above and hope that you get the great one black bear spawn 
don't shoot anything level four or below. The reason for this is the really small animals in Cordoward are often as rare or rarer than actually legendary animals. So what you want to do is get all the like one, two, three, fours on your map and then try and push for higher ones because the thinking is if you've already got the small ones there, then you've got a better chance of a great one spawning. That's the thinking behind it. So there we go, legendary black bear down. Let's have a look at locations of where to find them. Now this has changed quite a lot since the update. Here is where they were before, like mule deer, outpost. is not really any good now, but there was about 20 bears there, so they've spread them out across the map. Now the white areas are where you find black bears now. I've checked all these locations. Your map may change from when you first start it until you're say halfway through your grind because sometimes things change around from initial spawns to when you start grinding. An example of this is in the previous update Sun Sisters wouldn't have bears there for a start but later in the grind you might get a male there. So at some of these red locations where bears aren't you may find them there later in the grind if that changes. So I'm just telling you that now, just in case it does happen. So the basics are, drinking needs own time for black bear is eight at night till 12, allow 30 minutes either way, because you have to travel. I generally start at 9 p.m., then start hunting. If I don't make a full rotation while hunting and it runs out, I'll just change it back during the grind to 9pm and then hunt on. The white lakes are where black bears are. The red is where they aren't, but that may change, like I said, during the grind. The yellow locations are my favorite new locations for hunting black bears. So we've been making a brand new updated black bear guide for Silver Ridge Peaks. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm Ron McTube. Please subscribe to my YouTube channels and thanks for watching. Bye bye.